1075-1063. You're down with the king. I'm the girl doing the most CC. And I'm DJ, Mr. King. Yes, What's that's the king. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like that. I like the yeah. uh, flip, flip, yeah. flip flop of it. I like that. Mm -hmm, but we got another king mm. from the south. Come on now. Up in the building with his funny ass. Okay, y'all may remember him from Wild and Out. But he is a stand-up comedian, Big Daddy. Or big, I, big you, Daddy. You can call me oh, Big Daddy. Oh, no. like, now wait a minute. I'm like, hey, look, I get, I'm, I'm gonna, get I'm gonna leave this to y'all. I, I know I'm you got uncomfortable as soon as she I, said I, it. I did. I was like, I ain't know what kind of interview this. But was what I'm saying quick. is, that she can, she can call me Big Daddy. I, I know. I'm it's gonna, it's I'm Big Baby. Gonna, yeah, I'm gonna go back to the mix room. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be like Big Daddy, aka Big Baby, to y'all. Yeah, but if you call me Big Daddy, bro, you got to go. Oh, I'm out. You know what I'm saying? But Big Baby, I take. What's happening? What's happening? Now you. In the city because you're gonna perform funny bone and, yes funny bone easton and is this your first time in columbus uh, this is my second but this is the second. first time i hear on my own show so it's oh, not dope, dope. yeah it ain't no oh, 20 no minutes show. yeah i'm going yeah, yeah you're gonna okay. get the whole hour yeah okay. yeah 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 right. we know you crack jokes right and i'm pretty sure if anybody try to act any sort of way you're gonna call them out and roast do you i have to i have to do i don't like to i don't like to i don't like to because you was doing it on wild and out i know i so know do you like to roast people? i don't like roasting people i just only time i roast is when you try me Ooh. and the only reason i don't like doing it is because we're professionals yeah so that's so our job yeah, yeah, so yeah, it's, yeah, yeah so it's nothing for us to pick out the insecurity and attack it and then you know but it's different people it's sensitive these days you know you oh, you'll roast somebody right. outside at your car yeah. hey what's all that funny stuff you were saying at the show <laughs> and i was like bro i left that at the show yeah. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, right. I, I'm not the biggest. I don't like roasting, but I, it, I, it, it goes down if it got to go it, down. It, is that, though, an issue now, kind of like with comedy, because the society is so sensitive? Do you do you have to, you feel like when you're on stage, you got to, like, walk on eggshells? No, you never know, like, not, not anymore. Because okay, okay. if you come to my show, that's you paying, that's you coming, you know what it is. Right, right. And I also like to give an announcement at my shows. If you have any sensitive stuff about you, it's your chance to leave now. For sure. Because this is what it is. Right, okay. I don't think you should compromise your comedy for feelings. You know what I'm saying? It's, 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 it's supposed it's supposed to make you uncomfortable and think. Okay. Okay. I, I definitely respect that. And you know, a lot of people love the Dave Chappelle's, the Aerie Spears, the Chris Cole, Rocks. Man. Okay. But you know what? I be listening to like Aerie Spears podcast, uh -huh. and he said when he on the road, he don't do nothing. Until it's time for him to get on that stage and perform yeah. and go back to the hotel room yeah. and do nothing. Are you like that? Yes. <laughs> Why are yes. comedians like it, that? Man, we're we're uh we're introverts. You know what I'm saying? You Which got, is crazy. Yeah, right? because I know, think that I know. The opposite way, man. But it's so yeah. it's so hard making yourself vulnerable. You're telling people, hey, spend your time, spend your money, and let me heal you. Yeah. That's a very exhausting. Laughing is healing. Yeah, that's a very exhausting job though because we're doing literally all we do is pour ourselves to people all day. We're yeah. pouring ourselves to you all day, and people are receiving it, receive it, and you're, it's draining. Right. It's draining, but it's you know when it's when it's God is working your passion, it don't matter. So what do you do then to to almost I guess rebuild yourself night up day right. day Man, day I, if you on the road doing all this all the time? It's uh, in the middle of traveling. I hit the gym when I can. Uh -huh. I know it don't uh -huh. look like it, but your boy in shape. Okay. You know what I <laughs> mean? Um, <laughs> it's it's a lot of music. Um, I'm I'm very uh, plant based friendly. Okay, that helps okay. out a okay. lot. Um, and I, and, and a lot of prayer, man, a For lot sure. of prayer and a good circle of friends around you to keep you motivated, keep right. you going. Yeah. So what that, what's your playlist look like? Man, I got, mm, you know, I'm Who a big, you right I'm a big, right I'm, a big I'm a big Drake. I'm a okay. big Drake. I'm oh, on that like, way. Rap, 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 he rap, like, like, no, he Drake. looked like he liked to sing and Drake. I, That's why you judging me? Why you judging yeah. me? No, it's okay. We can I do, okay, I, do I do, I do, I do, I do. I'm on that <laughs> funeral right now. I'm a big okay. Wayne. That's my guy forever. For sure. You like the funeral? Yeah, I do, I do. Okay, I'm, I but I'm a too. Wayne. I'm a Wayne fan, so okay. Okay. you can't ask me to debate. Okay. And I'm and I'm big on that R&B, man. You know, okay. R&B isn't like I like the Summer Walkers. I like the Party Next Doors. Yeah, I'm yeah. into that, man. I need okay. Miguel to come back out with something. Yeah, well, I just you know what I'm saying. Just yeah, yeah, I need I need that, yeah, and that okay. and that puts me in a good mood, man. Okay, that's what's up. I can rock with that. I can rock with that. So you know. Oh, you used to be on Wildin' Out. You right. was with the hit. Were you with him, man? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sharon, I was, I, I was on there six seasons, six seasons. Yes, yeah, and Sharon. Yeah, oh no. God, Sharon. Because I'm a battle rap fan. For real. Yes. I, I didn't, I didn't become a battle rap fan until I joined the show. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna ask you a question. Okay. If you had three rounds. Three. Three rounds. Uh huh. And you had about like two months uh -huh. to prepare. Uh -huh. Could you be one of those guys? Absolutely. Okay. Which one? Which one? Cause Hitman Harlem, I, I, I get you. I would probably I say, I would probably say conceded. I would probably say conceded, cause he ain't battle rapped in years. 
Okay, so you think he rusty? And I think and I think he rusty. Think I think he, he rusty. rusty. <laughs> he he been cutting the beat so long, he might not even know how to even start his battle rap. Okay. But Hitman still be in the trenches. In Hitman, mm -hmm. I feel like Charlie that's still Hitman. Be my, the battle there. I'm gonna Talk get the clips. I'm gonna get the clips. Oh, oh, Hitman, oh. my boy. But I think I think I also can't take him seriously because I that's my boy, and we've been we've been filming TV for yeah, six yeah. years. So yeah. like when he started getting to the when I get the gun, and I'm like, Jerry. <laughs> 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 Hey, yo, let now, me come on, now, come on now, girl. <laughs> you love your girl. You out here. You out here. You out here. You out here. Yeah, yeah. You out here, you out here blessing people. Yeah, you out here yeah, yeah. buying gifts and PlayStations. Stop, girl. <laughs> so let me ask you this. What's what's uh with battle rap? What's what's one of the funniest things that battle rappers do to, in your opinion? Bro, when they just get all up in your face, bro, yeah. like that's that's, they be so close, bro. They be like cheat to cheat. Yeah. They almost be kissing. Yeah, yeah, they yeah. I seen your grandma. Yeah, call to buy self getting groceries. You be like, why are you bring her? Yeah, and they get so personal, bro. Like bro, when I they watch, like, I watch some of the stuff that she plays in there. I'm like, yo, like that's that's you gotta fight. Like, you yeah. gotta fight. <laughs> but it was one battle rap. They found out one of the dudes used to work at Walmart. So his whole Rob round, his whole round was about self check out, customer service and yo, check out. Self check out. Now we it's all time. now we all start somewhere. Yeah, yeah. but that's tough. And yeah. to me, to me, clips is the goat. Okay. Out, of, out of Wild and Out. Okay. Out of, Cause okay. Clip, Clips is my, that's my dog. Well, you and know he, he's and one I, of the best freestyles in Period, period. History, yeah, so like. I want to be surprised. I wasn't surprised to see him on Wild and Out. I, I wish, go. I wish when I was on, when I was on the show, I really had used Clips more for my Wild style. Like, mm -hmm. Clips helped me out. Cause I wasn't a Wild style person. I'm, I'm more of an energy fun comic guy. Mm -hmm. And when the Wild style happened, I always be like, look, there's nine rappers on the show. Do your thing. Right, you know sure. what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But if I could go back, I wish I could sit with Clips and kind of like, Come up with some more, cause he. I mean, I've seen him literally off the top, yeah. Fry him up, right, yeah. yeah. And then yeah. don't give him, yeah. don't give him a chance Rebuttal. to write. Yeah. yeah. Don't give him a chance to write. And you know he got that mannerism when he start looking you up and down. That lip get the quivering. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. You know okay, what I'm talking. If you ever found him, don't bring up his daddy because he gonna get mad. Yeah, I love clips. I ass. love <laughs> clips, man. Clips, Con, <laughs> Hitman, Sharon. I love Sharon, man. Uh, those six years that I was with them boys, man, it was it was dope to see them in profession. And it's dope to see them come to my shows mm -hmm. and respect my profession. Aww. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, you know, Hitman done been to a few shows. You know, he'd be like, man, what? Boy, y'all, I want to do that. I'm like, no, nah, you stay in your battle rap. Let me do my thing. But I love them boys, man. Our girl, Justina Valentine. Oh, yeah, yeah. She kind of got under some heat because kind of like you were saying earlier, like uh -huh. if you get out of pocket, I'll roast you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or that, you know, while and out, sometimes y'all be roasting yeah, each yeah, other. Yeah. And celebrities real. come on as guests all the time yeah. and they got to get a little roast session. And, changed, and sometimes though. they go back yeah. and forth with y'all. Yeah. But, you know, with her and Black China. Ooh. And that's my, and that's and that's what they, that's what they aired. Oh, wait, what? That's what they aired. It was more. So you don't know what happened on the live show, yeah. You know, wow. you know, you only get twenty minutes of the show on TV. It right. takes two hours to shoot. Mm -hmm. So yeah. there, there are some comedians who your Carlos's, if you will, right. Corey Holcomb's, who say whatever. A lot of that stuff not going to get aired, but on the Corey live show, hilarious. Wow. But you know, you, everything's political now, so certain things you can't say. But there are a lot of comedians who just don't care, or who do, who just do whatever on the show. <laughs> but the live show is way better. <coughs> way better. Right, 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 right. Way better. Right. So, and, so, oh, oh, go ahead. Go. so speaking of uh, your live show, so yeah. we talked about earlier, like I said, like how you know you 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 really try not to roast nobody, right? If it, if it gets to that point, <laughs> give me a, give me a time where just like you maybe I had that heckler that you just oh had that man, somebody that was because drunk. Mom, nine yeah, yeah, yeah. They like, nine times yeah. they drunk, nine okay. times they drunk, they excited, or, or they real, they or they real fanned out, and they just trying to balance it out. Okay. All right. uh, I had a guy who was in the front of my show one time talking the whole time, and was, you could tell this girl was like, "Oh my god, please shut up." Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because she saw me noticing them over and over. And then finally, I just turned. I said, yo, put the light on them. I said, because oh. obviously, he want to perform. Ooh. And so when that happened, you know, he was embarrassed. Mm -hmm. He was trying to put it down. I'm like, no, nah, no, nah, stand up. I tell you what, because your girl not going to give you none after a month after this, because I'm about to fry you. And I just, <laughs> and I don't even, I, th I think I just blacked out. And I just yeah. I just kept going. I'm like, how dare you interrupt me at your job and you out here fighting for a parking spot? I just kept, like, just going. <laughs> I just kept going. And then, yeah. you know, he finally, like, oh, I'm sorry, man, I'm sorry. But you know, yeah, I try not to, man. But we professionals, yeah. No, so no, you no. know, and plus you gotta understand, we had an advantage. We got the mic, and you don't. 
Yes. I tell, look, and nobody I tell came here for you. So yeah, so exactly. Automatically. Automatically. <laughs> yeah. I, I used to always tell people that when I was, you know, doing clubs or doing parties, like, oh, God. why you, how you, how you arguing with me? And I got the mic. Yeah, that's like, that's, you're, that's you're, not smart. You're not gonna win because one, they can't hear you. All they yeah. hear is, oh, 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 oh. don't he sound retarded? Now we won. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Now, now we won. We ain't yeah. even got started yet. Yeah. yeah. Besides the fact that you always making us laugh, whether whether it's on TV, on the stage, or on YouTube with your wake and bake videos, which I think <laughs> I are know. hilarious. I, I know, man. I got but my own strand coming out. That so. was just that's, that, oh, was that's my, that was yeah. my transition. Yeah, yeah. I was about to say now you turning that into something that you have fun doing. Right. Love to see people laugh and have fun with you, but now you turning that into a business. Absolutely. So when can we get some of that live. Okay? Hey, man, it's coming out and about the harvest to be ready in about another month. My goal you is. See, he, he's yeah. a real. That's why I was yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So it my, wasn't like that. You just took somebody and like, oh, I'm a no, 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 no. So I actually, really start, so hey man, I went shout out to G Five Cultivation. Um, it's a black owned dispensary and a, a oh. grower in oh, Vegas. Wow. Um, he, they, uh, Snoop Dogg actually posted a video of me way back, and they saw the video from Snoop. Okay, and so they started following me. They had they had watched me for like three months. And he had contacted me. He was like, man, I see you're very involved with the culture. I want to sit down and possibly come out with your own strand. I was like, that's a dream wow. of mine. Yeah, that's like, dope. don't play. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Don't don't play. Yeah. He was like, no, I ain't playing. I want you to come out to Vegas, da, da, da. I was like, you sure, bro? He's like, yeah. So he actually bought my flight. You know what I'm saying? Brought yeah. me to Vegas. And so with that being said, I was like, I ain't going to do this by myself. So I invited my closest comedian friends, mm -hmm. Tyler Chronicles from Wild and Out, Osama Ben Drinker, who I do videos with. Mm -hmm. They all came. We all came to Vegas, and we actually... I actually got licensed to go into the plant and touch my plants and grow and cut them and harvest them myself. That's dope. That's yeah, so I'm a, I'm licensed. Yeah, I'm licensed That's in Vegas. Lane, yeah. yeah, I cut. I actually cut the mother plant. I broke it down, got the stems off the feet, and I actually cloned the first hundred pieces. The first hundred plants. Look at you guys. Yeah, yeah. So, oh, man, salute. Yeah, so it, the yes. goal is to have a big comedy show slash karaoke night four twenty in Vegas, and that's what we're going to release. Can we get tickets? Okay. Absolutely, absolutely, oh, absolutely. Yeah, 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 we're going to do we Vegas. It, the, 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 it's going to be available in Vegas in L.A. as soon as the South and the Midwest pick up. Yeah, you know. And legalize it. Yeah, that. it's going. It's going to be able to come out here. Yeah, they with all of it. Yeah, in Detroit. Yeah, Ohio. They. But it's it's going to be ready in Vegas in L.A. Starting 420 and okay. then leading to the summer. That's what's up. That's yeah. big, man. Yeah. Big, baby big, big, big baby bud. Big baby bud. Big baby bud. Yeah. Okay. Sativa hybrid. Big, big baby. Big bud. baby. Big baby yeah, bud. Not, baby. Not, not what you were saying earlier. Big daddy bud. You said you off at midnight. <laughs> yes. <laughs> See, all right, look. I'm going to let y'all go ahead and wrap this up. He's about to miss his show, but yo, Big Baby, one more time. Tell everybody where they can find you, how they Amen. can keep up with you, all that good stuff. Uh, my IG, Darren Brand underscore D A R R E N B R A N D underscore website, darrenbrand.com. I'm, I'm working on the HBCU tour series right now. Other YouTube content shows coming out, Big Baby Bug coming out. Man, just rock with me. We're only getting started. We're yeah. only getting started. That's what's up, That's man. What's up. Salute to you, man. Absolutely, man. Appreciate y'all for having me. Real talk. You already know, man. Yeah, it's down with the king. You already know. <laughs> <laughs> I like y'all, man. Yeah. I like y'all. It was it was warm in here earlier. We hot here tonight. <laughs>